All right, so here's the deal. Google forced you to use or upgrade to Google Plus. Uh, well, you want and you want to back up your entire YouTube account. Now, it is possible to back up your entire YouTube account in one lump sum. You get a copy of all the original video files unmodified that you have ever uploaded to YouTube. Now, um, this used to be a fairly simple process. You'd go to the little, well, previously you'd go to the little down, uh, the little arrow, uh, then you'd go to uh, settings-ish, click here again, and Let's see, view settings. See, now it's not even letting me. I was going to show you guys how to do that, or you know, how it was, but it won't even let me do that anymore. Uh, for the most part, if you have separate uh, usernames, you now they force you have to use your email address to log in um, for just about everything now, but you can still choose to have a different name, such as um, mine's K Man Auto. Uh, to use as a YouTube. Um, I am a YouTube partner, producer, so on and so forth. Um, now the problem is because these are linked accounts, how do you back up a linked account? Technically it won't let you anymore. Uh, and of course it was letting me, let me letting me show this the whole time until right now. There, here we go. Nope, still not letting me do it. See, I'm, I'm, uh, I, I was able to do it, but um, and here's the workaround. Now I, I'm afraid to undo it because in case I can't get it back, I don't want to lose that. Uh... Ah, here we go. All right, now um, disregard what you're seeing all over on the left side here. Now. Normally, when you log in, you'd see your name. Now, this is remember, this is now with the new Google Plus. You'd see your name, then you'd see your email address. I don't care if anybody sees it, it's public knowledge. I'm a rather popular guy. Send me an email if you like. Send me hate mail, I'll send you a bullet. Uh, then you'd click account. Then you have this neat little thing called data tools. You'd click that, and um, select data to download. Um, you can download all 12 supporting products so you can download everything in your YouTube or er, uh, Google Plus account that's calendar, profile, Google Stream, Messenger, Drive, Hangouts, Plus Ones, YouTube, Voice, Circles, Pages, Photos, all of that. Then you just click create an archive and you can select what you want or unselect and select only what you want in this case, it would be YouTube. Let's just back up a few pages, though, and we can click View Account Data. Now, you can see all the different things in your account. Now, here's the key item. YouTube, My Video, Zero. YouTube, Favorite, Zero, Zero, Everything, Zero. Now, you see my YouTube username, it has it as my email address yet. We don't want that, but YouTube does not give you a way to change that. Okay, so here is the workaround. I know it's taken me a minute or two to get a minute and f four minutes to get to this point, but you just need to understand how all this works first. Okay, so please just bear with me. Now let's go back to YouTube. Now we are signed in as normal, so I'm still signed in and my YouTube account still shows as my K-Man Auto. But now we click the little down picture. Let's just go to my channel page, get rid of all this other, other crud going on. Okay, so we click the little down arrow. Now we got this. Now you notice here, it has something that starts to look like an email address. That's the key. So, what we want to do is let's go to our settings. 
Now this should be showing you the settings for your YouTube account. If it is not, um, it will say the uh, K-Man, for me it's K-Man Auto plus K-Man Auto, which is a man sub-managed account of my main one, which is the only way you can get around not using your full name or so on and so forth, something. It's really, I, I Google Plus is the stupidest, most confusing thing they've ever done. Uh, if not, um, you want to switch account and then it will ask you which one. Either you got your name, an email address, or or your YouTube sub account, which would so I can either choose Christopher Lessie or K-Man Auto. So we're going to make sure you have whatever one you're using for your YouTube selected. Click that down arrow again. Settings. And we scroll down. And we see third party tools. Here is the magic. Your page's username is, and mine is K-Man Auto, dash five five nine seven at pages dot google dot uh, pages dot plus google dot com to take advantage of third party tools by setting up a password for this page that is your gold that is your key click set up password now uh, please re-enter your password so i'd have to re-enter my password uh... so um, Blah 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 blah. Okay, set username and password for Kman Auto. So your new username is there you got it. This is an auto generated username. You can learn more if you so on and so forth. Create new password and then confirm password. I've already did this. I'm not going to do it again. Alright, so once you do that sign out. Make sure you have uh, copied let's see, yeah, sorry that was my emails. Uh, make sure you have copied um, it's easier to copy the uh, that quote unquote email address. Even though it's not an email address um, it's as good as an email address for the purposes we're going to. Um, so we're signed out of all my accounts uh, you you wouldn't see that new email address in here yet. Uh, once again, I've already did it, so it's permanently showing for at least unless I completely wipe that out. So you'd click Add Account. Uh, now I can't sign in as Kman Auto. They disabled that feature permanently with uh, Google Plus. So now you enter in that special address they just made for you, and then. Your email, uh, the password. Uh, what, what did I use? I, think I just set up some temporary thing. Okay, magic. Let's not save that. Okay, now we are officially signed in as Kman Auto, which is my YouTube account. That is what we wanted. Now if we go to data tools, let's just look at view account data first before we go to download data. If we go down, okay I have one photo in Picasso which I don't remember, oh it was probably my profile picture for my uh, channel. Uh, two about me entries, don't remember ever doing that. Oh look, YouTube. Username, Kman Auto. Name, Kman Auto. Gender male. I didn't know a business had a gender. Um, my videos, I got 59 private, 556 public. Uh, with my most recent being uh, with Great Grandpa and Gino. Bowling, December 2013. We took my grandfather and my youngest bowling. They had a blast, mind you. Um, my subscri subscribers. Uh, with my most recent being Homey Genius. Okay, interesting. Um, so, as you see, all my videos will now are now present. Go back to the page. Now I'll click Select Data to Download. Create an archive. And now you can select all the things that your YouTube name is used for. Now, 
like we like I said before, all we want is YouTube plus. Now, if you have a really small YouTube account, a zip file would be just fine. Personally, I'd like it if they would have supported RAR files instead, but there might have been licensing and whatnot with that. If you have a big YouTube account like mine, now I know mine's not huge subscriber-wise and view-wise. I got a few million here, a few thousand subscribers, and I'm growing at maybe four or five hundred a month as of lately with all my Tesla Model S videos I've been doing. But if you select uh, the next best one would be the best one would be TGZ, which is a different kind of um, uh, archive, um, commonly referred to as a tarball. Um, they make them; it can back up your data because it's it's going to do this in one lump sum. It's not going to do each individual video. This is meant as grab as much as your stuff and save it as you can which is old, old tripod. Made in Japan, though. This thing's from late 70s. I like it. It's rugged. Um, anyways, um, this will do files up to 50 gigs in size, and it'll split it up. Now, I have some videos where I've uploaded that were the, the raw file alone was 50 gig for a, a half-hour video, and I got some videos that are a couple hours long. So... TGB is the magic. Uh, you might need additional software required to open TGB, TGZ files on Windows. Just do a Google search on that and you'll come up with software for that. I do believe WinRAR, which is uh, my favorite RAR program, um, is more than capable. And you click Create Archive. And then... Um, uh, phooey. Um... Uh, Create archive. I'm not going to create another one because it takes a really long time and they limit how many you can do per day. You click that and it takes you directly to the screen. Same screen you'd get from clicking create archive. Um, this is just showing what is in progress right now. Um, this was a failed one. Uh, it is showing what, what the failed one was when I was under my uh, my email address username with my real name. So right now, archive is in progress. We're preparing your archive. 1% complete. I doubt it's even that much. Uh, data collected currently is 2.54 gigabytes. It will email me when the archive is ready to download. At that rate, it's been it's already been going for about a half hour. Um, at that rate, I'm expecting it to be done. Let's see, today's 11:23 uh, p.m. on Friday. I think it might be done. Uh, I want to say Monday <laughs> at this rate. So there you have it. Um, when it's done, it will email you. Uh, yeah. I, I deleted those. Um, I had gotten an email. Oh, here. This is uh, archive details. Even though it was a failed archive. Um, media, YouTube. Um, how do I download? Download each file to your computer. Keep these files on safe since they contain your personal information. How do I download it? Hmm. I guess that'll be a follow-up video for you guys. Um, oh, actually we're up to 3.7 gigs now. I'm expecting my... expecting to have about a terabyte worth of data to download. No, I'm not keeping it all. I just want to... Most of my stuff I have a backup of, but a lot of the early videos that I've done, I don't have any copies of any longer. And a lot of the recent videos I, I've done as well, um, the longer ones. So I got a nice shiny... Uh, I got three... Three terabyte hard drive, so that's nine terabyte. It's just dedicated to backup. And once that's done, then I get to crash planet. 
all back up to uh, for another backup. Yeah, is my car done charging yet? Oh, getting there. Oh, it is complete. Yeah, 90% charge. That should be plenty for tomorrow. That's going a little quicker now. Well, there you go. If you have any questions, yeah, I'm not the most graceful at making these videos, but I try to be concise and accurate. Uh, it's important you have control of your data. Please let us know if you have any problems. If you decide to take your data elsewhere, blah, blah, blah. Okay, archive details. You know what? Could be because I'm not directly signed in as my email address. I'm signed in as Kman Auto now. Um, is why it's not letting me download this one because that one was done with my name and my email address. So, yeah, we got a long ways to go. So, if anybody has questions or needs me to clarify anything, um, Go for the comment section down below. Um, you're also welcome to uh, contact me in private. Um, I do my best to help you. And I know, just bear with me on this, I know uh, this whole Google Plus thing is one giant train wreck. So hopefully this, this really helps everybody out. Cheers and uh, Merry Christmas 2013.